Hello everyone and welcome back to AJ Anime where you can find all things anime. Today, we've got something special for you. With its unique perspective when it comes to soccer, there are some crazy moments that'll have you jumping out of your seat. From humiliating their opponents to scoring insane super goals, here are the top 5 moments of soccer greatness in Blue Lock, the rising star in sports animanga. Spoiler warning, this video contains some info from the manga, and before we get into it, why not smash that like button and subscribe? Blue Lock is not your typical sports anime. Unlike shows like Haikyuu or Aoashi, Blue Lock is more brutal and highlights the selfishness and ego hidden deep inside each player. Shocker, isn't it? There's no power of friendship or teamwork in this anime. It's all about making your own goals and carving a path toward greatness even if it means stepping on others to come out on top. So stick to the end because the last one might shock you. Starting off this top 5, we have the moment Isagi devours Baru. In his first appearance, Baru dominated Isagi and Team Z. He was the lone king of the field, and to him, he was the main character. But that didn't last for long, did it? During the second selection, Isagi teamed up with Baru and Nagi, and during their match against Chigiri and the others, Isagi showed Baru just who the main character really is. He used Baru as a tool, and together with Nagi he became the man of the match. Baru couldn't do anything but watch as Isagi devoured his darkness and scored goal after goal, even throwing an insult while he was at it. What made this scene iconic was how Baru's pride was turned upside down to the point where he even passed to Isagi, something that he would never normally do. The animation was superb, especially when they were scoring and their auras were bursting out of their bodies, and they nailed the emotional impact this match had on Baru, making it worthy of the fifth spot. But before we get into more of the greatest moments in Blue Lock, smash that like button, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you won't miss any more videos like this one. Now let's kick off to number 4. Now who could forget about this moment? It might not be as spectacular or as flashy as the others in the series, but it cemented itself as an iconic scene because it showed fans the true potential of Blue Lock as a series. You could even say this was the opening salvo for the entire anime. The way this goal was timed was also something you have to watch out for. Team Z was already the underdogs in their match against Team V. They had no superstars like Nagi or Rayo, but at the end of it all, Isagi clawed his way to the top. This was also the beginning of Isagi's growth as a player that could control the field. The thrill, the soundtrack, and the heart-stopping final battle between Isagi and Nagi was a sight to behold. The blue and purple aura that emanated from Asagi, the sudden change in animation, the impact frames, and the hype once the ball entered the goal cultivated one amazing moment for the series as a whole. He used all of his teammates as tools so that he could win with his own goal, and even if a prodigy was creeping up behind him, he decided to take the shot of a lifetime. Again, this is where spoilers come in, so continue at your own risk. Speaking of Nagi, he pulled off one of the most insane combos in the entirety of the series, and even Ego himself said that his goal cannot be replicated by anyone, including Nagi himself. But why is this a once-in-a-lifetime goal? Well, it's because in this state, Nagi was in flow, and only in those circumstances, with his ego in full swing because of his desire to defeat Asagi, can this goal be made. Now that he has achieved that goal and no longer has any creativity or motivation, it's safe to say that this legendary combo isn't going to appear anytime soon. What made this moment so awesome was the fact that not only is a fake volley a super advanced skill, but the fact that he did five of these consecutively was in a league of its own. Isagi thought that it was only a two-stage fake volley, but the way that he was surprised in each move was just pure gold. Nagi even fooled Kaiser, who had Metavision that was better than Asagi's. This happened during the Neo Egoist League, and it was Nagi's finest moment. If you thought Nagi's 5-shot revolver fake volley was already amazing, you didn't know there was one super goal that took the entire world, not just Japan, by storm. So, who was responsible for this superhuman goal? Well, it was none other than Shidu, the second most skillful player in Blue Lock, and he pulled it off during the U-20 Japan vs. Blue Lock match. Everyone, not even Asagi, could believe what just happened. Shidu used every fiber of his being to make it happen, from his unique perspective on soccer to his overpowered extreme spatial awareness. All of his skills culminated into this one legendary moment. Even after Gagamaru headbutted the ball and successfully defended the goal from the attack, Shidu took the risk, performed a high jump bicycle kick, and from way outside the box, Shidu shot and scored. This gave the U20 Japan team the lead, and Ego acknowledged that Shido was the first one to achieve flow. Shido's super goal proved that even if he is not number one like Rin, he can pull off goals that no one could even imagine. And with the greatest moment in Blue Lock so far, 
There's no argument that this was the most thrilling manga panel for the entire series. Isagi's winning goal in the U-20 Japan vs. Blue Lock match was the goal that made Isagi Yoichi one of the greatest players in the series. So what exactly happened? Well, Isagi's ego was in full swing, and he was against his teammates and the U-20 Japan players. Itoshi Rin and Itoshi Sai were in their best forms, the score was tied, and they were in the final minutes of the match. At the final moment, when everyone thought Itoshi Rin was going to surpass his brother, Isagi comes in with a steal. Every hardship he faced, every realization he had, and every teammate he had to step on was worth it all for this moment. In the eyes of the entire world, Isagi emerged from Rin's shadow and scored the goal that made Blue Lock the star of Japanese soccer. I personally got goosebumps after reading this part, and I've never felt that in any kind of sports anime and manga. This was a world-class goal from a world-class series. And that's it for the top 5 greatest moments of soccer greatness in Blue Lock. If you liked the video, make sure to subscribe, like the video, and click the notification bell so you won't miss videos like this one. We upload weekly reviews, theories, and discussions about everything anime and manga. You can also leave a comment below on what are your top 5 moments. We would love to hear from you. Thank you for watching, and see you next time!